Napa Cabbage, Wikipedia Article Audio Napa or Napa Cabbage is a type of Chinese cabbage originating near the Beijing region of China, and is widely used in East Asian cuisine. Since the 20th century, it is also a widespread crop in Europe, America, and Australia. In much of the world, this is the vegetable referred to as Chinese cabbage. In Australia it is referred to as wombok. Naming Vegetable Origin Cultivation Soil requirements Climate requirements Seedbed requirements and sowing Fertilization, field management, harvest, storage, and yield, growth, development, and physiology, pests and diseases, fungal diseases, bacterial diseases, virus diseases, insect pests, other pests and diseases. Breeding The name Napa comes from colloquial and regional Japanese, where Napa refers to the leaves of any vegetable, especially when used as food. The Japanese name for this specific variety of cabbage is Hakusai literally white vegetable a Sino-Japanese reading of the Chinese name. The Korean name for Napa cabbage is Bichu, which is an irregular, nativized borrowing of the Chinese name. In Mandarin, Napa cabbage is known as Dabake, or big white vegetable, as opposed to the small white vegetable that is known in English as bok choy. Outside of Asia, this vegetable is also referred to as Chinese cabbage. Regionally, it is also known as sui choy, and celery cabbage. In the United Kingdom this vegetable is known as Chinese leaf, in New Zealand as wang bok or wan bok, and in the Philippines as wombok or pecha ibagyo. The name wombok is also used in Australia. Another name used in English is petsai or peetsai. In Russia it's called Russian, translate. Peking's Kaya Kapusta. Napa cabbage is a cool season annual vegetable which grows best when the days are short and mild. The plant grows to an oblong-shaped head consisting of tightly arranged crinkly, thick, light green leaves with white prominent veins. Innermost layer leaves feature light yellow color. Napa cabbage belongs to the family of Brassicaceae the genus of Brassica and the subspecies Pekingensis. As a cruciferous plant it is closely related to species like broccoli, pak choy, or cauliflower. Napa cabbage is widely used in China, Japan, and Korea. Napa cabbage is used as a sign of prosperity in China, and often appears as a symbol in glass and porcelain figures. The jadeite cabbage sculpture of Taiwan's National Palace Museum is a carving of a Napa cabbage variety. It is also found in North American, European and Australian cities after Asian immigrants settled in the regions. In Korean cuisine, Napa cabbage is the main ingredient of bicho kimchi, the most common type of kimchi, but is also eaten raw as a wrap for pork or oysters dipped in gokujang. The outer, tougher leaves are used in soups. It can be used in stir-fry with other ingredients such as tofu, mushroom, and zucchini. It is also eaten with hot pot meals. Napa cabbage is particularly popular in South Korea's northern Gangwon province. In the European, American, and Australian kitchen it is more common to eat it cooked or raw as salad. The vegetable is rich in vitamin C and has a fair amount of calcium. It tastes mild aromatic. The first notation of Napa cabbage cultivation date from the 15th century in the Yangtze River region in China. 
then it spread to Korea and Japan. Beginning in the 19th century with the Chinese diaspora, it was distributed to the rest of Asia, Europe, America as well as Australia. During the 16th century cabbage was first introduced to America from Europe and supply of seed materials from Europe continued till World War I. After the blockade of European seed supply the U.S. government research institutes and people in the seeds business develop superior seed stocks for every vegetable crop. Oregon and California were the cabbage seed production areas during that time. Today it is cultivated and eaten throughout the world. Napa cabbage might have originated from natural hybridization between turnip and pak shoy. Artificial crosses between these two species and also molecular data strengthened this suggestion. Napa cabbage can be cultivated in many different areas of the world, the main area of diversification represents Asia. Napa cabbage requires deeply loosened medium heavy soil. There must not be any compaction due to plowing. The crop achieves particularly high yields on sandy loam. Extremely sandy or clay-like soils are not suitable. The crop prefers a pH range from 6.0 to 6.2, a high organic matter content and good moisture holding capacity of the soil. Lower pH or droughty soil can lead to calcium or magnesium deficiency and internal quality defects. Napa cabbage needs much water during the whole growth period. Often an irrigation system is needed, especially for August and September. The required amount of water depends on the stage of crop growth, weather conditions, and soil type. The most critical stage after establishment is when the head is forming. Inadequate water at this time will result in reduced uptake of calcium. This condition causes dead leaf tips within the head what makes it unmarketable. During head formation, 1 to 1 and 1 half inches of water per week is needed to maintain sustained growth rates. Temperature requirements are low. Temperatures below zero degrees are tolerated for short time periods, persistent frosts below minus 5 degrees Celsius are not endured. Too low temperature can induce premature bolting. The plants perform best under temperatures between 13 degrees Celsius and 21 degrees Celsius, but depending on the cultivar. Napa cabbage has very small seeds with a thousand kernel weight of about 2.5-2.8 g. For professional cultivation it is recommended to use disinfected seeds to prevent onset diseases. With the single grain seed technique, about 400-500 g seeds per hectare is required, for normal seed technique about 1 kg per hectare. If normal seed technique is used, the seedlings must be thinned out after 2-4 weeks. The seeds should be deposited 1-2 cm deep, with a row width of 40-45 cm and 25-30 cm distance between the seeds. The seedlings can be grown in the greenhouse and then transplanted into the field after 2-3 weeks. Earlier harvest can be achieved with this method. 70,000 to 80,000 seedlings per hectare are required. The transplanting method is normally used for the spring crop and the seeding technique for the fall crop. The nutrient removal of Napa cabbage is high. Fertilizer recommendations are in the range of the nutrient removal. Organic fertilizer must be applied before sowing due to the short cultivation time of Napa cabbage and the slow availability of organic fertilizers. Synthetic and fertilizer should be applied in three equal doses. The last application must happen before two-thirds of the cultivation time is over to avoid quality losses during storage. Weeds should be controlled mechanically or chemically. Napa cabbage can be harvested 8-12 weeks after sowing. 
The harvest work is mostly done by hand. The plant is cut 2.5 cm above the ground. It is usual to harvest several times per field to achieve constant quality of the Napa cabbage. Storage of Napa cabbage is possible for 3-4 months in cool stores with 0 to 1 degree C and 85 to 90 percent relative humidity. Napa cabbage achieves a yield of 4-5 kg per m2. The leaves, which are the harvested organ, lay side by side densely, are lime green colored with white leaf veins and have a smooth surface. The vegetable has an oval form and weights 1-3 kg. The leaves are organized in basal rosettes. The flowers are yellow and have a Fabrasi KCE typical cross-linked arrangement, hence the name Cruciferi, which means cross-bearing. Because the plant is harvested in an earlier stage than flowering, normally the flowers are not visible on the field. It develops similar to other head-forming leaf vegetables, for example cabbage lettuce. The chronological stages on the BBCH scale are germination, leaf formation, vegetative growth, appearance of the sprout that bears the flowers, flowering, fruit development, seed ripening and senescence. Napa cabbage is an annual plant that reaches the generative period in the first year. It must be consumed in its vegetative period, so there is a challenge in cultivation not to reach the stadium of flowering. The stadium of flowering can be initiated by cold temperatures or the length of the day. Napa cabbage reproduces mainly by allogamy. Napa cabbage produces more leaves, bigger leaves, and a higher biomass under long day conditions than under short day conditions. Alternaria diseases are caused by the organisms Alternaria brassici, Alternaria brassicicola, and Alternaria japonica. Their English names are black spot, pod spot, grey leaf spot, dark leaf spot or Alternaria blight. The symptoms can be seen on all above ground plant parts as dark spots. The infected plants are shriveled and smaller than normal. Alternaria diseases infect almost all brassica plants, the most important hosts are oil seed brassicas. The fungus is a facultative parasite, what means that it can survive on living hosts as well as on dead plant tissue. Infected plant debris is in most circumstances the primary source of inoculum. The spores can be dispersed by wind to host plants in the field or to neighboring brassica crops. This is why cross-infections often occur in areas where different brassica crops are cultivated in close proximity. The disease spreads especially fast when the weather is wet and the plants have reached maturity. Alternaria brassicae is well adapted to temperate regions while Alternaria brassicicola occurs primarily in warmer parts of the world. Temperature requirement for Alternaria japonica is intermediate. There exist some wild accessions of Brassica rapa subs peaking ensis with resistance to Alternaria brassicae but not on commercial cultivars. These resistances should be included to breeding programs. Alternaria epochemics are best avoided by management practices like at least three years non-host crops between brassica crops, incorporation of plant debris into the soil to accelerate decomposition and usage of disease-free seeds. Onrachnose is a brassica disease caused by Colletotrichum higginsianum that is especially damaging on Napa cabbage, pak choy, turnip, rutabaga, and tender green mustard. The symptoms are dry pale grey to straw spots or lesions on the leaves. The recommended management practices are the same as for alternaria diseases. Black root is a disease that infects mainly radish but it also occurs on many other brassica vegetables inclusively napa cabbage. It caused by the fungus Aphanomyces raffini. 
the pathogen can persist for long times in the soil, therefore crop rotations are an essential management tool. White leaf spot is found primarily in temperate climate regions and is important on vegetable brassicas and oil seed rape. The causal organism is Mycospheorella capselli. The symptoms are white spots on leaves, stems and pods and can thus easily be confused with those of downy mildew. The disease spreads especially fast with rain or moisture and temperature is between 10 and 15 degrees Celsius. Yellows, also called Fusarium wilt, is another brassica disease that infects oil seed rape, cabbage, mustards, napa cabbage, and other vegetable brassicas. It is only a problem in regions with warm growing seasons where soil temperatures are in the range of 18 to 32 degrees Celsius. The causal organism is Fusarium oxysporum FSP conlutinans. Napa cabbage is relatively tolerant to the disease, mostly the only external symptoms are yellowing of lower, older leaves. The disease is soil-borne and can survive for many years in the absence of a host. Most cruciferous weeds can serve as alternate hosts. 15200 kg n per hectare, 8120 kg p205 per hectare. 18250 kg K2O per hectare, 110150 kg CA per hectare, 2040 kg MG per hectare. Black leg or fama stem cancer, Leptospheria maculans, club root, Plasmodiophora brassici, downy mildew, Hyalopyronospora brassici, powdery mildew, Erisife cruciferarum. Rise Octonia solani, Sclerotonia sclerotiorum, Heterodera shaktii, Meloidogyne hapla, Nacobus batidiformis, Rotilenculus reniformis. Damping off is a disease in temperate areas caused by soil inhabiting umi seeds like Phytophthora cactorum and Pythium spp. The disease concerns seedlings, which often collapse and die. Links to other diseases that infect Napa cabbage Bacterial soft rot is considered one of the most important diseases of vegetable brassicas. The disease is particularly damaging in warm humid climate. The causal organisms are Erwinia carotivora var. Carotivora and Pseudomonas marginalis pv. Marginalis the rot symptoms can occur in the field, on produce transit or in storage. Bacteria survive mainly on plant residues in the soil. They are spread by insects and by cultural practices, such as irrigation water and farm machinery. The disease is tolerant to low temperatures, it can spread in storages close to zero degrees Celsius by direct contact and by drip pint onto the plants below. Bacterial soft rot is more severe on crops which have been fertilized too heavily with nitrogen, had late nitrogen applications, or are allowed to become overmature before harvesting. Black rot, the most important disease of vegetable brassicas, is caused by Xanthomatus campstris pv. Campstris. Aster yellows is a disease caused by a phytoplasm. Nematodes are disease agents that are often overlooked but they can cause considerable yield losses. The adult nematodes have limited active movement but their eggs contained within cysts are readily spread with soil, water, equipment, or seedlings. Parasitic nematode species that cause damage on Napa cabbage. Brassica rapa species are diploid and have 10 chromosomes. A challenge for breeding of Napa cabbage is the variable self-incompatibility. The self-incompatibility activity was reported to change by temperature and humidity. In vitro pollination with 98% relative humidity proved to be the most reliable as compared to greenhouse pollination. 
A lot of work has already been done on breeding of Napa cabbage. In the 21st century, 880 varieties of Napa cabbage were registered by the Korea Seed and Variety Service. Breeding of Napa cabbage was started by the Korean Government Research Station of Horticultural Demonstration in 1906 to overcome starvation. As Napa cabbage and radish are the main vegetables for kimchi research focused on increasing yield. The most important person for this process was Dr. Wu Jang Chun who bred hybrid cultivars with self-incompatibility and contributed to commercial breeding by developing valuable materials and educating students. The main purpose of the hybrid cultivar was high yield and year-round production of Napa cabbage after 1960. To enable year-round production of Napa cabbage, it has to be modified to tolerate high and low temperatures. Normally sowing in the late summer and harvesting in late autumn can produce high-quality vegetables. As an example, a summer cultivar called Nacio Bicaro was developed 1973 by a commercial seed company. It tolerates high temperatures could endure high humidity in the monsoon, and showed resistance to viral disease, soft rot, and downy mildew. The low temperature in early spring reduces the quality of the vegetable and it cannot be used for kimchi. In the 1970s the developing of winter cultivars started. The majority of new cultivars could not endure the cold winter conditions and disappeared. The cultivar Dungpeng was developed 1992 and showed a high resistance to cold temperature. It is mostly used in Korea, where fresh Napa cabbage is nowadays cultivated all year round. In the 70s, one seed company developed the rose shape heading variety while other seed companies focused on semi-folded heading type. As a result of continuous breeding in the commercial seed companies and the government research stations, farmers could now select what they wanted from among various high-quality hybrids of Chinese cabbage. In 1988, the first cultivar with yellow inner leaf was introduced. This trait has prevailed until today. A very important breeding aim is to get varieties with resistance to pests and diseases. There exist varieties with resistance to turnip mosaic virus but as mentioned above, there exist numerous other diseases. There have been attempts to breed varieties with club root resistance or powdery mildew resistance but the varieties failed due to bad leaf texture traits or broken resistances.